Hey guys, this is John Muhammad. This is the Promised Marvel Avengers news update. And bro, I have to say, it's a lot to talk about. <laughs> so, first, we're going to play the trailer from the Marvel Avengers YouTube channel. And I know that I do not own the rights to this at all, but let's go. That's my disclaimer. Let's watch this, and all I'm going to say is you're going to be mind blown. Oh my god. I like how they did this too. This is cool. I don't know what. The good thing, you'll be able to hear my voice while we're doing a video too. Hawkeye right there. Hawkeye. K okay, Bishop. What? Dude, this is dope. That's all I'm gonna say. Super adaptoid. That was funny. Yes, he's coming back.
Wow. This is dope. I Oh my god. That's nice. Oh, wow. Wow. That's pretty cool. Wow. This is so cool. Hey, wormhole. What? Wow. Mm-hmm. Wow, she got way different costumes from most of the people. Oh, my God. Bro, oh, my God. This is the best part. Old man Logan, guys. Oh, my God. Guys, this is looking dope. And that's it. So I'm going to go ahead and go to the website. Oh my gosh, I want to try that again. So I'm going to go ahead and go to the website really quick. Um, they just did an update. Alright, so let's go there to the website because the other part of the news is that they finally did a patch that fixed so much stuff that um, was going on in the game, honestly. Um, it, it, it really did. They fixed a lot, guys. Mm-hmm. 
Yeah, where was that patch at? Nope, we passed patch 1.35. Oh, I guess I gotta go find it again. Okay, so I gotta find it. Okay. What what in what are you doing, phone? Stop it. Marvels. Okay. Nope. Um, patch 1.36 is already up. And I don't know why it won't. It's not showing it because I got the wrong thing. Come on, Google. Load. Stop taking 5,000 years. There we go. Weird how I have to go all the way here to get it. So, this is 1.36. In addition to a handful of multiplayer optimization of black screen fixes. You heard that, right? Black screens. So, they are really trying to fix black screens, bro. Um, we're not trying to, they, uh, preferably they fixed them all. So now we have the ping system, which I wasn't expecting the ping system acceptable by aiming the trigger and using the rectile to highlight the areas of objects you want to ping. Once highlighted, press the up on D pad will activate a ping notification. When aiming at ping objects, the rectal will turn red, except for when that gen doing a generic ping location ping. In this case, the circ rectile remain white. Pinging areas like hacking stations or smashing windows will direct your AI campaigns to run over and do the required. And yeah, so now your AIs can actually do what you need them to do. You need them to hack a door, hack a door. You need them to smash a door, smash it. I love that. All items except enemies will show a ping prompt when targeted. Enemies don't show this, so not to disrupt the flow of combat. Don't worry, they've been marked. Dismissing a ping is simple. Just aim at a ping item and dismiss you. I will pop up. It's worth knowing that ping functionality doesn't extend to doors which require the Avengers to assemble in order to progress. The players must still, oh my, never mind, sorry. The players must still engage, well they can go hack stuff, but it says the player must still engage with those terminals so that they maintain control over mission progress. Okay, I see. So like if you want doing the, the drop zones or defend the point. Fix a variety of black screen errors, a rare issue where black screen would uh, could occur when vetoing a mission at the time is zero, a rare issue where a black screen would occur when attempt to start a mission on players on a strike team in a different progression levels and campaign, a rare issue where black screen would occur when attempting a boss layer mission another strike team does not have. Fixed an issue where players could be knocked out of world on alternate versions mission when on their way to fight Taskmaster. Fix the rare issue where infinite load times occur when switching between heroes at the hero switcher or war table. Broad. That rare issue happened to me so much. I, I pray it's fixed. Fixed. And some of these issues they're saying that are rare or were really weren't. Like it happened a lot on console. Fix the rare issue while we're loading into shield outposts after the unlocking the viral campaign resulted in missions like Rain Supreme and Shield Substation so Zero remaining locked. Halting Avengers initiative progress. Rebalance enemies in the Olympia Archive campaign mission. Fix the rare issue of black squares with popular on Thor's face when hovering over major artifacts. Fix an issue with Hulk's animation sometimes gets stuck when initiating stranglehold from the air. Fixing an issue with strike team could be stuck on loading state for another player showing while the host is traveling to an outpost. Fix an issue where quick matches any hero could result in multiple Hulks on a single team. Bro, they fixed an issue where Iron Man's Magno missed consume more intense energy than intended. Okay. Fixed. So they fix an issue where vendor times occasionally hit zero. The refreshing. Fixed an issue where gear would occasionally not send to the locker room player. Inventory was full. So those are all the updates for um, Marvel Avengers. And I know y'all, you know, you got to see that I'm using my phone recorder. Sorry about that, but I just wanted y'all to be able to see it. Um, to like get my PC more set up to be able to do that. Uh, 
But I'm excited, and I like what they did, and I will definitely be playing Marvel of the Avengers tonight, uh, Willie. So if you want to play, I might play for about an hour or two on my Xbox. Add me at J A M I capital J, J A M I capital J, Jami. Gun and then one space and then Gundam, the actual word, if you know the anime with a capital G. Again, one space and then a word Gundam with a capital G. Then one more space and it's three sevens. One more space and it's three sevens. I did that because that's God's number. So, guys, I'm super excited. I love the direction that this game is going. And uh, y'all probably might not have heard it, but it's targeted on December 8th for Kate Bishop to come out. Um, and I figured it was like late November, early December. So perfectly it comes out because that's seven days from my birthday on December 1st. So that'd be nice. Or if it comes out early, that'd be nice. So I'm going to catch you guys later. Thank you for watching. Have a blessed day.